Hi Leo, my name is Debbie and I am an intuitive reader and I'm here today to give you your general weekly message from May 7th into the 13th, 2018. Please keep in mind that this is a general reading, so if you are interested in a private one, all the information is down below in the description box. So let's just get started, Leo. You first start off with the Knight of Pentacles. So the Knight of Pentacles I refer to as the double whammy card. Uh, it's that slow movement. It's as well as the four elements. The Pentacle is the slowest movement. So you've been really slammed with this slowness in regards to your happiness and love. I feel that you're looking out towards your future with that six of swords you want this movement okay you're looking out towards that but you're feeling a little lost this one really got to me the eight of cups okay I feel like you're kind of it reminds me of Arizona I don't know why I feel like saying Arizona but something to do with Arizona somebody can re uh, resonate with that I don't know Arizona just came to my head but I just feel that um, you're just kind of lost okay you're, you're just like you're just walking down like this you see how dark this is and and it's kind of it was like the weirdest feeling which is kind of I'm just lost because of the slowness but I'm looking out towards my future because I want this I, I want this I've been waiting for this for this movement I feel what are you waiting for this uh, ace of cups here this is that new beginning in regards to love but it's just kind of like I'm lost without this love because it's taking way too long I feel definitely in regards to a love relationship with the lovers card here now this is known as the uh, Gemini card as well so you could be dealing with the Gemini but I really feel that you want this balance back into this life okay into this relationship with the four of Pentacles here it's kind of wild because it's kind of like it, it's kind of like this feeling of here's your energy here holding this in kind of feeling and but the person is t just doesn't even look at you kind of feeling okay and it's kind of like this is the person that you want but you know you're trying to regain this balance back okay it was a wild message. I feel that there's definite changes, though, with the Five of Wands here. You've been through the ringer. You've been through this battle kind of feeling, okay? But with the Five here, and from what I can tell here, the Fives are known for that change. What is that change detail? The Fool card right underneath that. So I do feel that there's going to be some type of change for this new beginning, okay? I feel that you're going to be offering this abundance back into somebody's life that you are totally in love with, okay? I feel that... It's kind of wild. Um, this this slowness, I feel, is coming to an end, all right, with the Ten of Swords here. And it's pretty wild if you take notice. And they draw my attention to certain things, and you can't miss this. You see how the Fool card's hand is kind of like this, and she's kind of like that back? It's kind of like they're waving to each other. So this tells me is that, hey, you know, this is coming to an end, and that there's going to be this new beginning, all right? I feel that ending is in regards to that slowness, all right? Uh, your outcome cards are the Nine of Cups. So this is that wish fulfillment in regards to love. Now you have the King of Pent or the King of Cups here. So definitely in regards to love. Now you could be dealing with a water sign as well, okay? But I feel de definitely, I feel forever this is resonating for, it's not going to resonate with everyone, obviously. But there is a wish fulfillment, I feel, for whoever this is resonating with this week. So that is what I have for you guys this week. I hope that this helps. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Also click that little bell on the side to get updated information. I do weeklies and dailies. Have a great week, guys, and I'll talk to you soon.